Hey, it's good day, everybody. This is Sports Time News. I'm Joe Bork, and this is going to be a video on the USA, baby, getting off to a great start against Latvia in the IIHF World Championships as Team USA was able to have a wonderful 4-1 to one win over Latvia, led by Strassmann, who I did a video on in general, signing with the San Jose Sharks as a goaltender. If you want to go back and check that out on my channel, I'll link it at the end of this video. But he had a very good game <clears throat> in cage where Elvis Mers Lincolns kind of struggled um, for Team Lafayette. A goaltender I'm very fond of. The former team of Oscars Bartu was a good defenseman uh, for Team Lafayette for years there. Um, Riley Barber was able to get a deflection. There's not a lot Elvis Mers Lincolns could have done there. Obviously, Seth Jones, though, that goal went through his wickets. You could tell from Mers Lincolns' reaction. He really wanted that one back, and he really should have had that one. So that was an unfortunate goal for Ms. Lincolns, but a fantastic goal for Team USA as Golchenyuk and Nate Schmidt were able to get the assist there. With Bordalo, that goal was crazy, as that was one that Seth Jones ended up making a pass that was too far in front of Tomas Bordalo, the former Michigan product. That was a great player for that studded Michigan team at University of Michigan and had good games for the Sharks and Barracuda to round out this season. Had this one-handed kind of like slapper goal into the net, basically, and then Lafferty um, smoked it, assisted by the newly signed Jacob Magna. And then when it comes to... Mafia, the guy that earned the goal, Durzin, um, uh, Andres Dur Durzins, I think is how you say his name. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm all for certain names like that. Um, Durzins, um, I guess would say it would be it. But either way, he had a very nice goal. Um, being able to uh, get that nice rebound puck hound type goal for Team Latvia. So they were able to avoid the shutout, but I thought Strassmann played very good in net. He wasn't tested mightily in this game, but it was a good first game for Strassmann in net in the IIHF tournament. And overall, Golchenyuk's of the world. <clears throat> um, Lafferty obviously played very good. I thought Megna played good, who's one of the big defensemen for them. Seth Jones played good, getting an apple and a goal. Um, the apple was more because of Bordalo somehow being able to one-hand that. And then Peak Andrew Peak also played well. Keith Bellos also played well. So everybody you want to see that's part of the core, the youngsters and the veterans all played well. And the Golchenyuks being veterans, Riley Barber being a veteran as well, Lafferty being a veteran. And then you have the Belloses of the world, the Andrew Peaks of the world. And, of course, obviously one of the goal scorers, Thomas Bordelos of the world playing well. And Strauss Mann, the youngster in that. So I think Team USA... Is a team that, of course, has a chance to win this entire tournament, just like I think the team I'm going to be doing a video on soon. Team Canada also has a chance to win this entire th thing. They got off to a great start by Riley Barber. I would say one of the stars of the game has to be Seth Jones, had the goal and an assist. Another one also has to be, I would say, j he did get it just an assist, obviously, on the Lafferty Blast, but I would have to give it to just how good he looked defensively. You can't just always give stars for just a score sheet. Jacob Magna did look very good as one of the key defensemen for Team USA um, in this tournament. And then I would have to say for the third star, I would. that's a tough one in this one, but I would have to say you would just go with the guy that had the leading goal, got them right off running. I would go with Riley Barber. He was the leading scorer for the Griffins this year in the AHL, and he continues his hot season into the IIHF World Hockey Championship Tournament as Team USA gets off to the 4-1 to start in the tournament. America is starting strong as Team USA starts strong in the IIHF Worlds. Please continue to subscribe down below. Above the easy to use widget, keep channel growing to the goal of 250 or more by the start of June.